What a waste of fruity goodness. Honk! Oh hi dude, you're there to be an obstacle are you? Oh well. Oh hi, bye. Oh what's this, some dodgy timing? No! You might still be alive, but yeah you are. And there's a box back there. Oh! Hmm. Good, that's deactivated still. Why wouldn't it be? Because silly. What the hell? The laser sight was going through the building, and yet I still hit him. Never was a very accurate gun. Yeah, I hit something eventually. Ah, juicy. shinies. Leave no gem unturned, apparently. Wait, does that mean I got all the coloured ones? No, it doesn't. Guess it just means I got 20 of them or something. Bug light. Why is it spelt like that? Light, as in like the demo version. The preview version. Unlock a new path by earning all the colour gems. Wait, in this level? I don't remember an, an all gems path in this level. Oh, good. It's a good level to be favourite because it's got snakes and crocodiles in it. And it's an Egyptian one. And it's a platformer one. It's got everything. What a shiny fat. I've always got to have these gosh darn timed darkness levels. Hurry up, I've got a time limit here. Chase the... oh. No, don't chase the bug, I've still got another one. I didn't even notice. Ah. Well, there's probably no point going up here then, is there? It's not going to go anywhere. Oh, darkness, cover me. I don't know if I've even ever been here. A cut above the rest. There's probably no point going here either. Wait, I already said that. Yeah, I should just turn back now. Might as well see what I can though, I suppose. What an easy level. Crash 2 was the only hard one. Hi Kakudemon of seriousness. Oh, I probably should have exploded that nitro back there. I don't know if it matters. Probably doesn't. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Uh, oh. Okay, that's the end of it anyway. I guess they'll probably... Wait. No, this is fine. I thought I was on the gem path already. 
Quick. Quick. Woo woo woo! Why is it night time out here now? Maybe it was before. Whoa, what the hell? Maybe there won't be a Nitro Explodo box at the end of this. If they're just going to give me this. Oh, you don't need to slam them. Buddy, can I get you? A drink. No, you can't. It's well dark in here. Oh no, I feel like I remember this one being annoying somehow. Like maybe you have to not get the fly. It's probably fine. Yeah, because you don't have time to do this, I think. Ah, oh, I can't see shite and heft. Hello? Oh. Oh, what the hell. I'm down here somewhere. Uh-oh. I'm here. I made it. Oh, and I got all the boxes. Fine. More like Coco Catacoot. No, Bandy Cat. Yeah, because she can see in the dark. I can anyway. Is that it? No, not me. Oh, I touched the crocodile's ass. I'm sorry, I couldn't resist. It's too beautiful. Yeah, it would be nice if he would glow in the dark like the good old days. Ah, tasty. Thought I was going to miss it there, because it wasn't actually there for a moment, but it was. I guess since fireflies started existing in the world, he decided to get rid of that power so he could have an easier life with less energy drainage. Or some cheese. The final dance, maybe. <laughs> yeah. Plenty of lives. And to think I was worried about losing them all earlier. It's not funny, really. No, you're not. This is the part where I'm supposed to be angry, full of rage, incensed. And we are. Once again, you have outsmarted and outspun my best oh. intentions. I should be rather upset. And. Oh, right, that was it. Oh no. Now this is probably probably my favourite Crash Bandicoot final boss of the first three anyway. Don't remember any of the others. In fact the only other one I've ever seen is uh Wrath of Cortex. And I don't Oh no, maybe I no I don't remember it. I dunno. There was also one of the Game Boy Advance games that I've played, but I don't remember it. Oi! 
because it's actually challenging. And not a joke, like Crash Bandicoot 2. Well, the final boss of the first game was quite hard, I suppose, but that was less interesting because it was just dodge shots on a small area. He's got a cool hoverboard, I want it. It is quite a long fight though. <sighs> oh no, not this one. This might be the worst one. It might not be though. Oh no, whatever am I gonna do? No it isn't, it's absolutely fine. It just goes in an 8 pattern. No, you're still a joke, Cortex. It's too easy. God. They should have put a racing level as the final boss. That would have been hard. Oh no, how am I going to dodge that? Oh no, how am I going to dodge that? Oh dearie me. Oh dear, careful. Oh! They are still doing that. I don't know why I thought they wouldn't be. There we go. Cortex incarcerated. Meow. Yeah, it was still cool. I guess it's more of a satisfying fight because it feels fair but also challenging. Oh, oh good. I'm glad they kept in the and a woman with nice big bags of ice for my head. I was worried they would have changed that. Because it's a bit suggestive and sexualizing women or something. Yeah, any excuse to have more dingo dial would be a good one. Right, we don't need credits. I'm sorry everybody who made it. You're all cool, but no. I don't know why I even bother recording, like, credit sequences in my playthroughs. Like, I'd, I guess I'd do it to respect the people who made it, but nobody watches the credits. And we've already respected the people who made it by buying the game. Right, anyway. I don't remember how we get to the bonus warp room or whatever but we'll have a quick look I just want to speed run this one quickly because this is the only level I speed ran of this game and I have to do at least one well I don't but I might as well and it's almost ish four hours so I don't I don't know how long I can be asked to spend... Oh, what? I have to get five relics? Oh, never mind then. I don't want to do that. That's probably why I've never seen that... Oh, the UFO racing level then. Because I don't bother with the relics, because they're too annoying. Oh, 